They say closed mouths do not get fed, it is true. One often does not find if they do not seek, and if you do not ask, you may never know if it would have been given unto you. Over it. I live in America now, so it, it, it's, I'm hearing it all the time. Um, but the first season when I first played Beth, I didn't want anyone to know that I wasn't American. I mean, people knew. Kelly Riley's acting career embodies the aforementioned expressions in the actual sense. From dropping out of school to pursue her dreams to writing the producers of a TV show requesting a role, Riley literally took her life by the scruff and went for what she wanted. Have you subscribed to our YouTube channel yet? If you haven't, kindly touch the subscribe button and tap the bell icon to get a notification for the next time we drop one of our interesting videos. There are lots of interesting details to learn about the Yellowstone star, and this video practically covers everything. To start, learn these 10 quick facts about her. 1. She was born in Surrey, England, to a police officer father and a hospital receptionist mother. 2. Kelly Riley got married in 2012 to her lover, Kyle Bauer, who worked as a financier. 3. She left home at 16 to work as a waitress before her acting career started. 4. Riley got her first acting role by writing to the producers of the show, Prime Suspect, to request an acting role. She was called in to audition six months later. 5. She won the Spotlight Award at the 2012 Hollywood Film Festival for her role alongside Denzel Washington in the film, Flight. 6. In 2003 at 26, she became the youngest nominee for the Lawrence Oliver Theatre Awards for Best Actress. 7. Late Philip Seymour Hoffman and Marvel actor Robert Downey Jr. are her favorite actors. 8. She won the Best Newcomer Award at the 2005 Cannes Film Festival for her role in the film, Russian Dolls. 9. In 2005, Kelly won the Empire Award for Best Newcomer for her role in the film, Mrs. Henderson Presents. 10. She was estimated to have a net worth of $5 million in 2020. Well, kind of. It was a long time ago, but she was, uh, she was incredible. She was fierce and brilliant and everything I wanted to be as an actor. Now, let's look at her life in full. Born Jessica Kelly Siobhan Riley on July 18, 1977, in Chessington, London, she is an English film and stage actress. Her mother worked as a hospital receptionist, and her father was a police officer. She has Irish origins from her grandparents' side. Looking at all she has achieved in her career, both commercially and critically, one cannot but imagine how tragic it would be if she had not taken the bold step though several years back. Her story has inspired many people in different fields to take proactive steps in pursuing their dreams when and where necessary. Kelly Riley grew up in Chessington, a part of Surrey in London, England. She had her elementary and secondary education there, attending Tolworth Girls School in Kingston, where she studied drama for GCSE. The actress grew up with her elder brother, Neil, who pursued a career as a professional golf player. They were raised as Catholics, but she has leaned toward another path since becoming an adult. Kelly's foray into acting makes for an intriguing and awe-inspiring story. At age 16, she discontinued her education to focus on pursuing her acting career. She took a job as a waitress while she searched for film roles. Riley wrote a letter to the producers of the TV show, Prime Suspect, requesting a role, and six months later, she got a response. She auditioned for a role and played Polly Henry in an episode of the series, which aired on ITV in 1995. Kelly Riley started getting acting jobs in Trickles, and in 1996 she appeared in an episode of Carlton UK television period drama series, Bramwell, where she played a young, disturbed wife, Kathleen Lasso. Over the next five years that followed, she appeared in several small roles on TV shows like, Paul Dark, Charmin, Rebecca, Pie in the Sky, The Children of the New Forest, and Wonderful You, amongst others. Her first big break came in 2001 when she starred as young Amy alongside Helen Mirren in the film, Last Orders. Prior to that time, she had been worried about being typecast in comic roles and wanted a new challenge. It is noteworthy that she worked with Terry Johnson in four stage productions, Elton John's Glasses, 1997, The London Cuckolds, 1998, The Graduate, 2000, and Piano Forte, 2006. The producer once described her as possibly the most natural, 
died in the wool, deep in the bone actress, he's ever worked with. In 2002, Kelly starred with Audrey Tautou and Romain Duris as Wendy in the French comedy film, L'Auberge Espagnole, The Spanish Apartment. She reprised her role in the 2005 sequel, Les Poupées Russes, The Russian Dolls, and the 2003 follow-up, Cast Tête Chinois, Chinese Puzzle. At long last, she got her first lead role in 2008 in the horror film, Eden Lake, where she played Jenny. This job was followed by another key role in the British television series, Above Suspicion. She also starred in two other films, Sherlock Holmes and Triage in 2009. She reprised her role in the 2011 Sherlock Holmes sequel. 2012 was yet another massive year in her career. The year saw her act alongside Sam Rockwell in A Single Shot and in a lead role opposite Denzel Washington in Flight. Kelly made her Broadway debut in 2015 alongside Clive Owen and Eve Best in Harold Pinder's play, Old Times at the American Airlines Theater. Yellowstone is an American drama television series that premiered in June 2018 on the Paramount Network. Taylor Sheridan and John Linson created the show, and it stars Kelly Riley, Kevin Costner, Wes Bentley, Luke Grimes, Cole Hauser, and Gil Birmingham. The series follows the conflicts along the shared borders of a large cattle ranch, a native reservation, and land developers. The series has four seasons, and its fifth season is scheduled to air sometime in November 2022. Kelly is part of the main cast of the series, and she plays Beth Dutton, the daughter of the lead character played by Kevin Costner. Her character is a financier, and although well-educated, highly intelligent, and a master manipulator, Beth is bitter, emotionally unstable, and suffers from a substance abuse problem. She is loyal to her father and is in love with Rip Wheeler, who is her father's right-hand man. The series has gained popularity among show lovers, and Kelly's role is one of the most talked about. Her portrayal of the sharp-mouthed and fierce Beth has been lauded and is one of the most interesting to watch. Speaking about filming the show and how hard it could get sometimes, Kelly described a particular day on set in a scene where her character was running towards a pack of wolves. They were real wolves, they were tamed, but they were still real wolves. They had like invisible fishing line on them with two people lying in the grass, so if they had have charged me. I kept saying to them, you really think that that's going to stop them? And they were like, well, we can't do anything else, Riley said in an interview with Parade. Kelly was in the movie 10 by 10, a British-American thriller film released in 2018. Her character is kidnapped and locked up in a 10 by 10 room where her abductor questions her about her past life, which she is adamant to talk about. The ensuing drama is full of suspense and just the right amount of violence and bloodshed. Yet another one of Kelly's topical roles in the past decade, Flight is a 2012 American drama film directed by Robert Zemeckis. It stars Denzel Washington as William, Whip, Whitaker Sr., an alcoholic airline pilot who miraculously crashlands his plane after a mechanical failure, saving nearly everyone on board. William is hailed a hero by all and sundry, but an investigation soon leads to questions that cast the captain in a different light. This film is loosely inspired by the plane crash of Alaska Airlines Flight 261, and it was both a commercial and critical success, receiving praise for the directing and acting. Flight had two nominations at the 85th Academy Awards. Kelly had her share of ups and downs in relationships before eventually finding the one. In 2000, she started dating British-American actor J.J. Field. The pair parted ways in 2002 for reasons unknown to the public. Kelly and Israeli actor Jonah Lowden sparked relationship rumors sometime in 2006. They then dated for a while and even got engaged. The intending couple, however, broke things off before a wedding could happen. Rumors surfaced yet again in 2008 linking her to British filmmaker Guy Ritchie. Kelly denied them, claiming they were simply two professionals working together. Her husband of nine years, Kyle Bauer, is a financier who hails from Southampton, New York. Kyle leads a very private life. Not much is known about his personal life as he is hardly ever in the spotlight, nor has a social media presence. Kyle and Kelly met in 2012 and got married the same year in a ceremony in Somerset, England. They both live in New York City, 
The couple has no known children at the time of this video. Sometimes, it is demanded of actors to lose some clothing and show a little bit of skin. Other times, they are required to go even further than losing some clothing. While some actors won't sign such contracts, some have no problem with getting out of clothes on set. Kelly Riley has shown a number of times that nudity is not an issue for her. She has appeared in a couple of steamy scenes where a fine degree of her topless body is shown. In the 2008 film, Bikini Lake, she appeared in a romantic scene where she had just her bikini on. In the Russian Dolls, there are some flashes of Kelly Riley topless. She takes it a notch higher in Ms. Henderson Presents, going completely topless, and in Puffball, she goes nearly completely unclad in an adult scene. In the films Dead Bodies and Joe's Palace, there are full-blown adult scenes where she goes almost entirely unclad again. Kelly Riley is estimated to have a net worth of about $5 million in 2020. Her career is over two decades old, and she has appeared in TV, live action, and stage productions. She has been stacking up the paper over the years, even before her big role in the Yellowstone series came along. Kelly has had a productive career that seems to be on a steady climb. She has remained on the periphery of a breakthrough for so long and seems to now be enjoying the most successful run in her 26-year-old career. She leads a quiet and private life off the screen and appears to be in a stable marriage with her husband, Kyle. Indeed, there is more to come from the versatile and talented screen diva. I'm full in and then it's sort of like coming out and then I watch it and I'm, I don't even remember doing some of the scenes. I'm gonna kill you, Jamie. Are there some quick facts you feel like we missed? Please let us know in the comment section below and check out this other recent clip from Cydamex Entertainment. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.